In this GlowShift Gauges installation video, we'll show you how to install a GlowShift 7 color HPOP gauge into your 1999-2003 7.3-liter Ford Super Duty. When you're ready, grab your tools and we'll meet you in the garage. For the purpose of this install, we'll be using a 2000 7.3 liter power stroke to install our gauge. If you purchase the GlowShift HPOP sensor harness adapter, start by locating the injector control pressure sensor on the driver's side valve cover and disconnect the wiring harness from the sensor. Connect the GlowShift HPOP harness to the engine wiring harness and plug the opposite end into the sensor. Using a butt connector, connect the green gauge harness wire to the green wire from the HPOP harness. Then, use a butt connector to connect the black gauge harness wire to the black HPOP harness wire. If you did not purchase a GlowShift HPOP sensor harness adapter, you'll need to attach wire tap connectors to the sensor wires. Start by removing a portion of the wire loom. Place a female wire tap connector on the blue and green sensor harness wire. Place a female wire tap connector on the gray and red sensor harness wire. Attach a male wire tap connector to the green gauge power harness wire and place it into the connector on the blue wire. Then, attach a male wire tap connector to the black gauge power harness wire and place it into the connector on the gray wire. Feed the gauge harness wire through an open grommet in the firewall and into the cabin on the driver's side. Be sure to keep it clear of any moving parts. Remove the factory pillar from the truck. Place the single gauge pod onto the pillar and mark the inside of the cup for drilling. Using a step bit, drill a hole in the factory pillar at the marked location for the gauge wiring to pass through. With the pod on the pillar, Drill a hole in each corner of the pod. Use the included push-in fasteners to secure the pod to the pillar. Remove the kick panel and run the connector for the gauge power harness up through the dash. Mm -hmm. 
Feed the connector through the pod and secure the pod to the pillar. Plug the harness into the gauge and place the gauge into the pod. To enable the dimming feature, use a panel pop tool to loosen the dash trim and remove the headlight panel from the dash. Using a test light, locate a headlight wire that receives 12 volt power when the headlights are turned on. Attach a wire connector to the orange wire from the gate. Then, attach a wire tap to the headlight wire. and plug it into the tap. Reinstall the panel. For this installation, we'll be powering the gauge using expandable circuits, which can be purchased through our website. Using a test light, locate a fuse that receives constant 12 volt power. Then, locate a fuse that receives 12 volt power when the ignition is turned on. Attach the first expandable circuit to the yellow wire from the gauge. Remove the constant 12 volt fuse, place it into the circuit and place the circuit into the fuse's location in the fuse box. Attach the second expandable circuit to the red wire from the gauges. Remove the ignition 12 volt fuse, place it into the circuit, and place the circuit into the fuse's location in the fuse box. Attach a ring terminal to the black wire from the gauge and connect it to a clean, reliable grounding source under the dash. Reinstall the kick panel. Power your gauge to ensure that everything is working properly. You've now successfully installed your GlowShift H-Pop gauge into your truck. If you have any questions, concerns, or comments, please contact us at 1-888-GS-GAGE, and we'll see you on the road.